everyone. I hope you're having a great Saturday morning this morning. Uh, we're going to be pushing pause on our study through Philippians for today. Hope you have a great weekend off, but we're going to be starting that back up again on Monday morning. So I encourage you to join us for that. If you haven't been so far, you can always catch up on the previous videos that I've been uh, leaving here on Facebook and YouTube. Uh, I just wanted to drop in really quick though and talk through what tomorrow will look like. We're not going to be having service tomorrow at 10 a.m. at our church like we typically do. But I would still encourage you to carve out that time slot, 10 a.m. on Sunday, as a sacred and holy time for you and your family. And so I wanted to talk through the main elements of our service and how you could possibly emulate them at home. The first main element of our service is worship. And I would encourage you to queue up some songs on Spotify or YouTube that you enjoy singing along with in praise and worship to God. If you've got an instrument, that's great. Why don't you lead your family in worship through that? It could just be you, your spouse, or all your kids. But I would encourage you to spend some time singing worship. It could just be a cappella singing songs like the doxology or Amazing Grace that you're really familiar with. But I would encourage you to sing songs out loud to God with your family. And if you've never done that before, that feels a little awkward, I encourage you to start now and push through that awkwardness because that's just what makes it holy and sacred and special. The second main element of our service is prayer time. And I would encourage you, if you have any prayer requests or updates that you would typically serve, uh, that you would typically give during our service, uh, to share them in the comments or send us a message, send me a message or a text so that we can know how we can better be praying for you and your family during this upcoming week. The third main element of our service is communion. And you will have to provide that yourself for your own family members. Uh, you don't have to get exactly grape juice or bread if you don't have those available to you. But I would encourage you to get some kind of beverage or food available to remember Christ and his sacrifice on the cross in that way. The fourth main element of our service that I would encourage you to emulate tomorrow in your living room is our offering. And if you have any gifts or tithes, we don't currently have a way of giving online, but you can always mail any gifts or tithes that you have into our P.O. Box, P.O. Box 85, Alta, Iowa, 51002. We'd really appreciate any gifts that you have for us during this time. The last main element of our service is the message, and we're going to be continuing our series through the miracles of Christ Jesus. I look forward to sharing that with you tomorrow through video, and I'll have that available for you guys tomorrow at 10 a.m. So again, I hope you guys have an awesome Saturday. I hope it's relaxing for you and your family. I hope you can, are able to stay home and have fun, play games, or do other things. I don't know exactly what you're planning on doing, but I hope it's an enjoyable, relaxing Saturday, and I'll see you tomorrow.